Hi, this is Janos, it's Real World Audio, and today I'm bringing you two videos. Uh, so these two videos are about material selection for loudspeaker cabinets. This is something that, that uh, you have been demanding uh, quite frequently over the last uh, few weeks as uh, for building loudspeaker cabinets. And I've been constantly referring to my videos I made on the subject. And uh, actually I looked at them and they haven't had any views whatsoever. And uh, so this video is about showing you those two videos I made on the subject. These are very exhaustive videos. And, um, and please watch them uh, because <laughs> in detail I describe what what makes a, a, a material, a type of wood, unsuitable for a quality loudspeaker building and what makes it desirable and how you can choose for yourself. So this is the blueprint for wood for cabinet making. So this is the first video. And uh, there, as you see in the introductory picture of it, I say don't build a shed or a cupboard, build an instrument. So, so that is our guideline, that's our guiding principle that uh, uh, don't think that you are building a cupboard where you put your shoes in or that you put a, a vase or a TV set on top or your iPad or whatever. Don't take that mentality, forget that. That's the mentality where the whole loudspeaker cabinet industry started out with. That was the guiding principle of the very first uh, loudspeaker cabinets back in the 20s. And, and even today that mentality still carries on. And, and uh, what uh, modern loudspeaker building industry is doing is building the same uh, shoebox cabinets but from high-tech materials. So, so forget that, that sort of mentality. Uh, instead, go back to the uh, instrument making side and that's my recommendation for those of you who want to bring uh, a different perspective to loudspeaker cabinets, to loudspeakers, that is going from a, a mechanical, highly processed, a highly sculpted, over-sculpted sound that you get from today's high-tech loudspeakers. And, and if you don't really... Uh, maybe even if you like that or, or just you want to have a different high-level approach, then uh, this path that I describe, how to get high-quality wood, for your cabinets that that is something uh, worthy to explore and um, yeah so this is the first part don't build a shed or a cupboard build a music instrument so here i explore what kind of problems there are with lower grade woods lower grade materials and the second one is it's titled wood selection for loudspeaker cabinets higher grades and uh, that's just uh, a shoot from the video. This is where I show those materials that work for uh, live cabinets. Even if you go for dead cabinets, much you will have much, much, much better result if you use higher grades uh, than the lower grades. So if you have your favorite inert cabinet, but it's made of MDF, then use a high grade uh, Baltic birch plywood or other ply that I describe in this video and you will have a, a much better sound. The, a sound from the, from the speakers, a sound that is not just uh, has those audiophile qualities that you were looking for, but also has the uh, birth of proper tonality attached to it. So Thank you. That was just my very short introductory video to these videos and uh, I will have the uh, two, these two videos coming up at the end of video so you can click on the screen. But if not, I will have uh, 
also links to these videos below in the uh, description and comment section. So, so thank you for watching and have fun with your uh, loudspeaker building projects and um, have an awesome day. Bye bye.